Good morning, everyone. It's Vicki, and I've been busy making um, a lot of projects. And what you see is one of the projects I made, um, which I, I'm going to meet uh, some YouTube friends today. And so I made these, um, these boxes. This one here is for Robin Laura, the Robin Laura, and I'm going to see her and Elise today. So it's um, and um, Marissa and I are going over um, to meet them, and so I have little goodies for them. So uh, originally I thought to make a little um, sewing box, and I think I showed in one of my previous videos. It was a uh, like a four by four box. Um, that I made for um, uh, just for crafting, you know, put some needles and um, some thread and and little teeny scissors in there just in case I needed it at my craft table. I could not find those boxes, but I did have these boxes which are pretty big, and so um, but I only had two, so um, I made them for. Um, Laura and Elise, and so um, this is the box I came up with. I took it had a tile on top, and um, so on top of here, I had to crack it off, and um, then it left an, a little indention, as did the other little sewing box that I originally made. Um, <clears throat> and so I did put a puffy little um, topping on it. Um, and so she can stick stick pins in there if she wants, um, and uh, like that. Um, but uh, I, I realize it's kind of big, so I don't know, you know, where she's going to put it. But um, anyway, it's um, it was a silver color, and so what I did was just paint it with a. Uh, uh, pink uh, acrylic paint and then I um, well first I, I put the crackle on it and then you put the pink paint over it and so that it crackled and I don't know if you can see that but um, let me turn a light on I don't think that's any better let me go up close so it did crackle and um, I distressed it, the knob here, I painted it and then distressed it. And then I put these laces around and frayed the little um, material there that goes with this material on the top. I did put um, rosettes across and um, little beadings. I'll show you on the top, looks like. Um, it's in a string and the little tiny beads. Um, Kind of iridescent. I did put some um, some rhinestone chain around the edges, and it goes all the way around. And in the back, I put my little um, angel, um, which I'm finding I do that to all the boxes even though this doesn't need to be held up, but, um, so I just put that all the way around. And then on the inside, I put a little, um, this is some lace I got from, um, Marilyn G. And she wrecked me with a bunch of laces. I got this little trim in um, downtown LA. I thought it was so cute, but he said he only had that one little piece. But it was beautiful, so um, I got that. Marilyn made these, um, the mold for me. And so I parted with one of them. <laughs> what is going to the infamous Laura? So, um, and I put a little backing that I made, uh, with her card, um, I made her a card that has that on the, on the card. So I just put that there, she can put a little picture in there if she wants. 
and then um, you know I have a, a few goodies for her so that's this box I'm gonna set you down here sorry get this one out of the way and then this one goes to this one is for um, Elise and it's the same box it's the um, silver silver box and um, this one I put a, a, some crackle paint and um, some kind of uh, antique um, antique white paint on there and um, and so it has a little crackle I have uh, put this um, quilted material on the top with batting on hers and then I have a little bling here here's the cloth clasp I came with and then this is the um, this is a ribbon trim I got in downtown LA um, and then I put a little tiny, I don't know if you can see it, I'll go up close it's really pretty it's on the top too I put it on the top and um, I'm here and here and um, you can't see it but it's around around this behind the bow right there so um, I put that on it it's kind of subtle and then around and it looks like this and it has a little bow there and angel of course I have the um, rhinestone trim and on the inside I put um, I, I had made this and it was a card but it went so well it was an envelope card it went so well with this um, with the with this box that I put it on the inside of the box and then um, have just plain on the inside have some goodies in there for her made her a, oh I made her a little cupcake maybe I'll show you that so I made her a cupcake and I made it differently and um, I made it with the same brocade and I made it on the I put it on the bottom I sewed it and glued it, put a little trim down at the bottom, and then I uh, put a little trim at the top, and put this uh, flower that I got in downtown LA, it comes like this, so cute, um, and then I have the top is this little crown. And then underneath has the uh, brocade um, quilted material that I sewed on there. And it looks like that. Um, I did make this um, little bag with the, um, with the doily that um, Jelly Girl gave me. Um, and so I put that on there. That's how it goes, but I'm when I put it back in the box, it's it's gonna look different here. <laughs> and I did do um, a little clasp. Has uh, this little? It's an earring, but I made it like a you know put the clasp on there, and then you can put it in your um, journal or um, whatever. So <clears throat> that's another box I made and then I made um, Marissa this box which um, I couldn't figure out what I was going to do for Marissa because I ran out of uh, those boxes with pincushion 
So I made her this box. I had it in my stash. And um, I think this is a, kind of a taller Michaels box. And um, this is what the top looks like. And so, and that's one of my new flowers. So, um, I put uh, the doilies that Marissa gave me <laughs> on there. Thanks, Marissa. And I put on some cameos to represent motherhood. And um, then there's a bling at the top. And those are recollections, um, uh, bling and pearl spray there. I guess it's not a spray. It's just a, a bling. Um, on the box, it is crackled, painted blue. Actually, it was a Tiffany blue. But um, when I crackled it with the white paint um, or cream color paint, it... Um, it looks like a light blue. So that's the top. And then here is the here is the front of the box. I put lace all the way around. And then this is another lace I got from um, Marilyn G. Hi Marilyn, thank you. And um, this is from my stash. And then all the way around it's the same. And here's my little angel in the back. Um, and that is the box inside the box. I covered it in a lace I got from Marilyn, Marilyn G, um, the wide lace, and then I put Recollections Butterflies and a um, Michael's Bling there. I put some on the sides, I put that Chinese braid, where, which I got in downtown LA also. Then um, I have some flowers for her and some goodies, but on the inside I did the same. And put the lace, um, I put a, a, a ruffled lace from um, Marissa and um, put it all the way around inside the box. And she can put whatever she wants inside, trinkets or whatever. But, um, that's for Marissa, and um, so I was going to tell you about the flowers I made, so I'm going to let you look at that for a second. So the flowers I made um, last week, I made this, oh, sorry, I made this flower, as you recall, and I followed a tutorial for just the center part, and um, it didn't come out the way that hers came out, I didn't do it right, but I like the way it looks, and um, I put a rosette uh, puffy flower cut up, you know, um, underneath it, and so I like that flower, I like the way it came out, um, so then I tried to make another one, and, um, this is what it came out to be like, and, and what she said is she wanted to make a, um, a rosette, uh, out of material, um, and she was making it out of um, some 
organza material and um, I just happen to have this material handy this one here and so that's why I made that one um, then you know I made this one and I see where it kind of looks like a rosette or mine does hers looks a lot better but um, I still wanted to recreate um, oh and then here's another one I made that looks like her um, her rosette of course, in the organza, it looks even prettier. But um, I think it's not that I want to um, make, recreate a rosette. And so um, my happy accident was um, to my advantage because that's, <laughs> that's what I liked. I made this one, and I'm just holding that bling in there because I didn't put one in. Here's what it looks like without it. And the cotton material makes it a lot, a lot fluffier. Um, uh, shabbier. So, those are the ones that I made. I think I made um, Laura one also. Uh, so, these are kind of in the beginnings of, of, my, of my new flower. And I made here another one. And it looks similar to that one, but it's bigger, and so you don't see as much of the rosette. But for Laura, I sewed um, a nice little brocade um, material. And so um, that's what it it's like if you would like some kind of tutorial on on this one um, you know I can do that I'll, I'll probably be making a lot more this weekend since I have more time and um, then using different materials kind of um, experimenting but um, if you want a flower like this um, I'll direct you to um, the tutorial from the lady who um, I uh, uh, learned this from, and that her name is a YouTube name is um, Spare Marbles, and there's hmm, I think it's 2012. So um, I'll recheck that, and um, but if you want to know the if you can't find her and you want to know exactly her link, um, uh, just post a message to me. And um, that's all. I'm, I'm going to wrap these up and um, get ready and go to um, meet the girls. So, um, oh, I think I need to show you one more thing. In just packaging, I guess I made uh, these little muslin bags from Michaels and um, put a little doily on here and little, little um, feathers. And then this one I stamped uh, with my French stamp, and then I put um, that flower spray. And then this one here, I put um, this flower, which looks like a prima flower, I'm not sure. I don't know where I got that one. It's a nice dash. And the paper bag lady doily. And then I just put this little clip with the sunglasses and a gear. Um, so she put that in her file facts. So um, that's okay. So that's all I have for you guys. And um, I'm going to go and have some fun today and shopping. And um, I'll check y'all later. Okay, bye.